Merry Christmas morning. Guess what I just had the bright idea to do? A Christmas vlog. I haven't done just a regular vlog in such a long time. I don't even know if I still know how to do it. I mean, I know I post my little mini TikTok vlogs, but those are not nearly as detailed. But I said, you know what? One of you all posted. I read, I still read all the comments, y'all, even though I might not reply to everything like I should. Somebody posted that they missed my Vlogmas. And I was like, aw, but I ain't doing it. <laughs> so anyways, today is Christmas morning. Merry Christmas, you all. Um, I'm going to take y'all on my Christmas day with me. So currently, I think it's a couple of minutes to 8 a.m. I just got out of the shower, shampooed my hair, um, and I'm sitting here retying my own perimeter of my sister locks. Um, I've done this little part, this front of the perimeter, and then I'm going to go on to this side right here because I have a photo shoot tomorrow and my hair had like two week old curls in it. It just wasn't given. So I was like, should I do straight hair for the photo shoot or should I give some curl? And I particularly like the body that comes with, um, when I set it on flexi rods or just whatever type of curl I decide to do. So that's what we're doing right now. And then it's Christmas with the family. Ugh. So excited that I get to be home this Christmas with my family um, and not in disguise. Okay. So anywho, let um, me stop talking, finish this up because Christmas starts at noon this year. My mother wanted an early start to Christmas. Usually we start like around 3 p.m., but she said, Lexi, send out a text, tell everybody to be at the house by noon and make sure they bring their own Tupperware if they want to take some food to go. So <laughs> that's the energy she's on. So I said, okay. Then I woke up this morning and decided to do my hair. So uh, yeah, y'all, um, got a roller set. And I'll probably actually end up wearing the rollers over to my mom's house because I'm going to get over there just a little bit earlier. One, because I have the dogs and they're ready to go. They've been here a couple of days and they don't like being here. Um, and two, I am in charge of the drinks for Christmas. And if y'all are on Instagram, like I'm on Instagram, you see all these influencers and content creators doing all these fun Christmas drinks. And I wanted to get on that and just have a little fun with my family. So I need to go over to my mother's house and just, um, prep my holiday beverage station. I'm excited about it. If y'all can't tell. All right, y'all, I'll be back when um, the rollers are in my head and it's time to leave the house. Oh, and one last thing. I do also see all of the compliments that y'all leave in regards to my locks. Thank you so much. Um, I know I've done at least like the first year of me having locks. I did a few little updates or something, but I never intended on being like a lock content creator. It was just to show my process. Um... So, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely not doing any more lock content, but, you know, y'all were kind of a part of that journey, and y'all are always complimenting my growth and the styles and the colors, and I just want to say thank you. Um, I still really don't do much. I get my locks retwisted every... Now I'm kind of moving to every two months. For the longest, I did every five to six weeks, and then at, I accidentally went two months at one point in time, and I was like, oh, it wasn't that bad. Like, the new growth was maintainable. It didn't look too crazy. And I didn't even, like, retouch my perimeter or anything. So I was like, I can probably go every two months and save a little bit of coin because my reties, um, yeah, they a whole bill. <laughs> so the less times I have to go a year, the more money I save. So I go every, let's just say every eight weeks now to get a retie. Um, my hair color, I've actually been doing myself. Um, my loctician, she colored my hair once that first time when I went like brown with the little highlights. Ever since then, I've always been doing my own colors to my locks. Um, I trust myself with color. Well, kind of not really, but I've always done my own color even before. I had the locks, so I know how to play with color. So I do it myself. Right now, my red could probably be touched up because it's dulling out, but nobody got time for that. So um, I hope that answers all your questions about my locks, if you even had any. All right, now, yeah, I'm for real done. Talking. I am Zooming this Christmas morning. Doing my hair was such a bad idea. Like, 
not a good idea. So I am flying and the dogs are back here holding on for dear life. I know a lot of y'all have commented and asked how the dogs are doing. They are well. Aspen is a very old man now. He's 14 years old and uh, <laughs> signs of old age are definitely kicking in. Eyesight ain't eyesight like he used to. His hearing ain't as good as it used to be. But he's still holding on. And big girl Denver just turned 12 on December 15th. And she's as healthy as can be. So, they're great. <laughs> All right, made it to the parental's house. Gonna start getting my beverages together. Junior, say Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, people. Okay, so I've been assigned the butler's pantry for my drink station. So I've got to clear all of this off and then set my situation up. Some of these rollers look so silly. But okay, y'all, so the first drink that I'm going to prep via the instant. So it's a lot of noises going on, excuse that. But um, that snow glove drink that people have been doing, where you get a wine glass and then some rosemary and then you hopefully get like the rosemary to stand up I'm gonna try to just like yeah like that um, and it's gonna be cute and then you put water in the glass and then you freeze it for a little period of time till the water is frozen at the bottom and then it makes like a snow globe look and you pour then you pour um another just like clear liquid on top and it looks cool that one that one's giving me the blues but y'all gonna see y'all gonna see okay actually before I stick them in, I'm gonna cut the top of them. Cause one, they're too, they're too tall to go in the freezer that high. And they just, they look better cut. Shoot. But now, back to the struggle of trying to get them to stand. The secret to the cold meat, this You know? Instagram girlies really make this look easy. It's not. Now to transport them to the freezer. <laughs> oh, Christmas starts in 50 minutes. My hair is not dry. The uh, next thing I'm making is just the sparkling iced tea, which is really simple. You get some Lipton iced tea the powdered one, and some Sprite. Some Sprite, and you mix to taste, and it's very good, very, very good. Okay, so yeah, this is my friend Shayla's recipe. She gave it to me, a three, a three gallon recipe. This, this beverage server is like two gallons two and a little bit more so she said for three gallons I do three cups of this and then two to three liters of Sprite and add more powder to taste well you know we're just gonna go with it let's see how it turns out she also said you put ice in here first and then add your your iced tea and your sprite so this should be pretty simple
11 gallons is what this is supposed to serve. So. <laughs> well, let me taste it and see what is happening. Way bigger than I thought they were. Ooh. That tastes like perfection. Okay, yep. now we're on to the bridge punch. But this isn't nearly enough. Like I had ordered HEB curbside and I ordered the big gallon thing, and I guess they were out of the green, so they only gave me one of these. They should have replaced it with, I don't know, I feel like I need more, more. Anyways, I think I have some green Kool-Aid, so we might be just mixing flavors of <laughs> different green, so I can get as much punch out of this as possible. I was going to make one um, unspiked and one spiked for the kids, but we can just add um, we can just add one to it if you want to expect. What's that? Four piece. Mm, it's good. Good piece. Good? Yeah. And then this is really simple. Whoa. Sprite and pineapple juice. And it's done. The recipe said you could do, I guess, like a sherbet if you wanted it sherberty, you know, like for kids. But we ain't doing all that. So I already poured the spider in. So now I have the pineapple juice. Oh, you see? I mean, it's still green, but I want it greener. Gonna add some Kool-Aid packets and some water in there. Yeah. Okay, clearly I just did my own thing. Okay, let's see about these big old cups. Let's taste and see. Mmm. I can add the other Kool-Aid packets. So I taste like more pineapple than anything else at this point. Oh yeah, look at that green. Welcome to Bridgeland. Now we have a problem. I made orange frozen freezy to go in here. <laughs> but um yeah. What do y'all think we should do? I don't know y'all. Over it at this point. Over it. <laughs> Using mommy's fancy glasses. It fits better in there. Y'all, I don't want to use all of these fancy glasses. And then I bought, so this is another Instagram one, right? So you put the orange frozies in the glitter, and then you drop it in there, and you do the champagne. And then it makes a really pretty, sparkly cocktail, mimosa. Um, we gonna figure it out. We just gonna figure it out. So, I got this from Walmart. I don't shop at Walmart, but um, this was the only place that I could find that had the glitter that I was looking for. So I did a little online order. Here's some sprinkles. I can probably rim the glass with these, right? Bottle of sugar and gold edible and white edible glitter packets. Let's just give it a go. I just sprinkle it. Yeah, boy, Look yeah. how pretty that looks. Ooh. What are those? It's oranges. Frozen oranges. Hey, she fancy. <laughs> Give my daughter an assignment and she overachieves. I don't know. I don't know what to do, <laughs> All right, 
So this is our setup so far. Iced tea punch, Grinch punch, mimosas, Jamaican sorrow, stepdaddy's homemade eggnog. Then I'm gonna, oh, I got some liquors back there if you wanna spike the punch. Um, my snow globes are still in the freezer freezing. So, and I think that's really it. I was gonna make another like mixed drink, but mm, this is enough for now. Doors are closing. I can hear people coming in. What's in the, the bottle, Angie? Hi, how are you? As requested, one Jamaica rum bar vodka. Okay. One peach tree, whatever. Schnapps, okay. And the real deal, the Jamaica rum punch here. <laughs> As you can clearly see, we're a bunch of alcoholics in this house. The real thing from the grandfather recipe. Okay. Your grandfather or your, or your from dad. My father recipe with 100% overproof Jerry and my nephew white rum from Jamaica. So, mommy had the good size cups. Perfect. So now I'm gonna ring them in the red sugar to go with the Grinch punch. All right, here is the setup. Minus my snow globes. They're still freezing. Isn't it cute? I'm so excited. Cheers to Christmas right, Day. It's now 1.30. Family is, I think, starting to finally trickle in an hour and a half later <laughs> but that's to be as expected right trying to get this hair as dry as possible so i can kind of take out some of these rollers um and not look like a crazy lady all day long but whatever <laughs> i mean let's say hi to the people hi lexi hey merry christmas merry christmas Trumps? merry christmas merry christmas <laughs> Uncle Nev. Merry Christmas. Okay. Merry Christmas. <laughs> More boys. DJ. Merry Christmas. Christmas. Norms. <laughs> Quay. Say Merry Christmas. Thank you. Carenza. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. He's old. He's old. Merry Christmas. He's 14. Oh, wow. Joshy? Merry Christmas. Andre? What's up? Say Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Laurel? Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Auntie <laughs> Merry Christmas. Say Merry Christmas. Mommy already said Merry Christmas. Angie, say Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Okay, I think I'm just missing the kids and the dogs is all. The boys inside? Um, back room. Oh, okay, I'm ready to eat. Ziggy, say Merry Christmas. Dan, you already said Merry Christmas. Aspen. <laughs> Merry Christmas, my old man. I love you. Okay. <laughs> Vegetarian. What is that? Vegetarian. Vegetarian. Okay. 
work. I can't solve this. I saw your tuna. Thank you very much. Fish. Turkey. Pork. Jerk pork. <laughs>
Put a little bit of Bailey's in mine. This is for the kid. No Bailey's for him. Oh man, I forgot to whip up my milk. Froth it. <laughs> There's marshmallows in the hot chocolate bomb. Now it's time to take the family photo. If people would get up and stand up. <laughs> and um, yeah, that's it. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. I hope this day has been very special, special, special for you all. Toddlers are screaming. So. <laughs> Hello, Yeah. 